Hello? Oh man, there it goes. That was weird. My mic stopped working. What what's 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 going on everybody? What's, good? what's happening everybody? Rogues Raptors Gaming here. Welcome to a very special episode of Farming Simulator 22. Yeah, that's right. It's it's my birthday today. I'm 40 years old. Thank you for uh, for tuning in. Um, I thought these things were supposed to make funny sounds, but apparently it doesn't. So uh, yeah, I welcome. Th thanks for tuning in, everybody. Um, so as you can see behind me, doing some farming simulator twenty two. Unfortunately, the farm that I had been doing for so long is no longer. I don't know what happened to it. So now. As you can see, I'm stuck with the Sunday farm for some reason. It like replaced my save game. I don't know why it did that. So that's where I'm going to be farming at today. Uh, yeah, so feel free to uh, to hang out and uh, let's get to farming. I'll take this off now because that's all. I, that's all I needed it for was to celebrate there. But yeah. Um, Westbridge Hills had some issues last time we uh, we played here, so hopefully that won't be the case this time. I can't guarantee that it's going to go smoothly, but we'll f hopefully get everything figured out. Hopefully the volume and everything is okay. All right. Um... So yeah, here we are back at the uh, at the Sunday farm. Um, you can see all the most of the big uh, nasty weed bushes are back. I guess I don't know if they're gone or not. Um, so yeah, oil seed radish, all that stuff. Probably should have rolled it. Didn't roll it. Don't have a roller yet. Um, but we'll get there. We'll get there. So basically what I'm going to do is just uh, kind of pass the time a little bit. So I am going to do some mowing. strange okay well it's gonna need to be done anyway let's see here bag it Cool, there we go. We are in a mowing state. This thing seems like it's filling up way too fast uh, compared to how it normally does. kind of strange. So what all probably end up doing is uh, do a couple hours of this um, and then switch over to Farming Simulator 23 maybe do a couple hours of that um, and then see what else the night has to offer because the night is young be 
be nice if the zero turn actually zero turned. Getting too close to the uh, laundry, that's for sure. What are you doing, baby girl? Just uh, messing around with my light. Don't want you getting hurt. I don't want you uh, getting shocked or something. I'm shocked, but better safe than sorry. So I guess this thing is holding quite a bit of grass, but it just seemed like it wasn't there for a second. Also have the uh, the John Deere mower mod. I was able to talk the other guys into getting that, so that is also an option which is available. I've already got this mower, so I'm going to uh, continue to use it. Hey, what are you doing? She is obsessed with my light today for some reason. There we go. See, we got a pretty big uh, collection over here already. It looks like it might be a little bit loud. There we go. I turned it down a little bit. I don't know if it's going to help or not, but we'll see. Yeah, for some reason I feel like I I can get a lot more grass in this thing. Um, let me I'm gonna drive it to the shop, and I'm gonna sell this thing because I don't think this is right. Whoa, there, buddy. Here, get up here and lay down. You're freaking me out. 
He's just sitting there staring at me. <laughs> Alrighty. Let me, let me, let me, let me, let me see here. We will back it up and detach it. Has inflated. Huh. Interesting. I just feel like I've. Weird. I just feel like I've had that, uh. had a lot more full than it than it was but who knows whoa I'm gonna have to look both ways cuz I, I feel like they're just waiting for me to pull out what are you doing baby girl Hmm? What are you doing? Where's your bone? Already. Daddy's streaming, baby girl. You need to get up here and lay down. It is definitely so much better with all those weeds gone. Much, much better. Hey, thanks, SP. I'm doing I'm doing just fine, my friend. I hope you're doing well, my uh if you uh if you noticed I'm able to speak, I got my uh procedure done and actually didn't even uh didn't even need to do anything. I didn't get any injections or anything, so that's that's awesome. And I hope you're doing I hope you're doing well. Thank you for the birthday wishes. It. Yeah, 
Yeah, I just feel like I was able to fit a lot more grass in this thing. Um, I'm half tempted to pick up the uh, the John Deere. To, I'm half tempted to sell this. You know what? I think I am going to do that because I had the John Deere on my other farm. Yeah, I've seen that. I was going to check that out once I uh, once I stopped streaming for the day. See your potato harvest look like it went well. I saw your thumbnail. Ooh, man. I wish my drink was closer, so I wouldn't have to reach all the way over there, but I'm, like, paranoid of drinking anything by my computer. I don't want any accidents. Whoa! Hopefully nobody else? All right. All righty. Say goodbye to the mow it. Okay. Um, let's let's see here. There it is. It might not look like much, but this thing is really nice. It's only $850, so I can go ahead and like just buy it outright. Don't have to worry about leasing it or anything. This sucker's mine. Um, and I am also gonna... Uh, let's see here. Oh man, what uh, what software do you use to edit? I use ClipChamp, and I'm not happy with that program at all. Hopefully, you some you use something a little better. <clears throat> um. The Lawn Sweeper, that's what we're looking for. This thing. Yes, fictitious capacity. <laughs> and it definitely is on that part. It is definitely fictitious. Okay, so that's all I need. Um, yeah. Yeah. Cap cut. Really, I've never even heard of that before. I'll have to take a look at that. Is it like the type that you have to, uh, um, pay to use the, uh, pro version where you remove the watermark and everything? So this might not be, you know, 21 miles an hour like the zero turn was, but I know for a fact this thing can definitely hold a lot more grass than the zero turn. The Moa pack is nice, but I know for a fact that this mod uh, just devours grass. I'm, I'm really sad that my other save game is no longer. I don't know what happened to it. I put in so much hard work on that farm. I did everything myself on that farm. I never hired a worker once. I did everything. I just purchased two or three new fields the last time I played it. 
I got you. Yeah, that's how most software is in this day and age now. You gotta like pay for the pro version and that's that's how I was using Clipchamp. I paid for the 4K capabilities. You can kind of move over where you where you want the grass catcher. I like to have it just right out of the uh, out of the chute here. Well, I thought I turned it on. Yeah, I'm not really sure what's going on here. Okay. It wasn't... I said it wasn't lowered for some reason. It's kind of strange. Alright, there we were. Doesn't exactly have the same cutting width as the zero turn either, but I don't know why. I just like this old school lawnmower. It's just, it's just cool in my opinion. It's got that, that old school cool to it, you know? And you know we're already familiar with it because this is the mower that um, we'd used on the other farm, other farms I should say. Hey thanks so am I, this thing is uh, uh oh, <laughs> look at it stuck on a tree. There we go. I guess we can't get that little bit, but that's all right. Oh, that's unfortunate. I didn't think we were gonna get hooked on the tree like that all right there we go yeah basically the reason why I traded this mower in over the zero turn is because uh, for some reason I felt like it wasn't it wasn't uh, holding as much grass as it usually did so uh, the zero turn I felt like used to hold a lot more grass for some reason after you cut it the uh the the collector on it but and i know for a fact that this one holds a lot of grass so already familiar with this mower anyway there's a weed eater mod that i've seen that i might get at some point see how that works out
Let me just double check something here. Whoa. Okay. You know, I almost feel like this mower has a better turning radius than the zero turn anyway, which is kind of crazy because zero turn, it didn't zero turn, it just looked like one. Oh. Come on, you can do it. Nope, he can't. The only thing that had, you know, that was that was better than this mower was the speed and the cutting width on it, and that was about it. And and you could like totally customize it and make it look all crazy if you wanted to, but you can't beat a classic mower like this. And. We're only 50% full. As to where that zero turn, I mean, we, we'd still be mowing it, probably. There we go. Just wanted to make sure I get out of the way of these trees. Kind of a pain to go around all of them, but... Now I don't think I should have to worry about them anymore. I think that's all of them. I just got this one up here, but that's it. I went over to my boss's yesterday. Uh, his his entire race shop is flooded, and we ended up having to rent a trencher for the bobcat and basically cut in a big trench down the side of his yard just to drain all the all the flood water away because it's flooded out. His shop was flooded. Oh, I do too. I just wish I had a yard to cut in real life. Yeah, it was pretty bad. He he had probably there were some spots that had maybe six inches deep of water at least. Um, I mean, right up into his into his racing shop. So luckily, we were able to. 
uh, we have a bobcat dealer like right down the street and we were able to go there and rent the trencher got completely soaked and uh, covered in mud in the process but it saved his it saved his shop so and he bought me lunch that's even better I uh, when I left to go to the dentist this morning I seen everybody over there working and then when I left the dentist's office I ran over to uh, Walmart and got a little cake and I got some of the I got those hats and uh, and these these things for uh, for my birthday because I was gonna take them over there and have a little thing um, but everybody was gone when I got back unfortunately yeah it was nice of them we uh, we went out to the diner down the street Oh man, I'm sitting here mowing, not even paying attention. But we'll be able to see now how much grass this little thing holds compared to the zero turn. Um, we've seen the zero turn. I'll try to unload right next to where the zero turn was at. So, this pile right here to the right. Hold on just a sec. That sounded a lot like thunder. And that's because it was already. And it is still raining. It's, uh, basically rained every day since Tuesday yeah you can see this is this is quite a bit of, uh, of grass compared to that zero turn you went to a place a cow pen oh man hopefully you get that taken care of I don't really do animals on here. That's It's a lot of work in my opinion. Cool, there we go. So, that's all the grass that I got from the uh from the John Deere. Yeah, that is definitely some thunder out there. I need to try to figure out where I goofed up at. I think all along here. not collecting anything hmm.
Yeah, I, I totally understand that. It's, uh... I don't know. I don't really like the way they have the landscaping features and stuff. I just find it sometimes to be a little too difficult to use. But it's it's not really something that I mess with all the time, so I'm I'm sure that, you know, if you if you do a bunch of landscaping and stuff, it might make it worth it, but I don't really I don't ever really mess with it, so um but when I got rid of all these weeds here the other day, that was about the most in-depth I've ever gotten with it. Um, I was really impressed watching your video on how you were able to make the ground all around, like your farmhouse and everything, look nice. And I like the way you put the fence up all over, around. Kind of inspired me to try to make my farm look halfway decent and presentable, but I need to get the money first. Wow. Yeah, there's definitely, uh... Let me see out the window. I mean, I look out the window, the sun's kind of shining, but it is like thunder and big time. On my, uh, on my Farming Simulator 15, um, I don't know if you can see on the other side of the road behind my barn and my farmhouse straight ahead, there is uh, the field that's covered in lime right now. That's the field that I use for potatoes. Um, man, I can't even tell you how many, how many harvests of potatoes I've got from that field, but that is a huge field. Whoa. Really mean to whip it around like that, but oh yeah, yeah, you definitely made it look like a real farm. And I seen that and was like, man, that's really nice looking. I need to try to figure out something to do around here to make that look like uh, like yours. Because I mean, the way you have your fence set up and everything, that's that's what I do for a living. I do fencing and I really like the way that looked and just the way you like blended the ground in around your house really know what you're doing I wouldn't even know where to begin half the time with some of this stuff so yeah if it weren't for that video from you I probably wouldn't even give it a second thought about doing any landscaping around here I'd probably just keep it the way it is I mean I am for the time being, just until I get enough money saved up, uh, but after the fact, I definitely plan on trying to uh, liven the place up a little bit. There comes the rain. Now it's, now it's coming down. Sounds like we got some hail. I gotta see this. Oh man, yeah, it is storming like crazy outside right now. That's that's crazy. All right, man. Thanks, dude. Thanks, SP. Really appreciate it. Man, I hope my, uh... 
Oh, my power stays on. Starting to have internet issues now all of a sudden because of this storm. Yeah, that's, that's real unfortunate about my save game. I put in a, I put in a lot of hard work on that other farm. Alrighty. Hey, thanks, tough. My dog's not afraid of storms at all. She's he's out of it. She's sleeping. Well, now there's dark clouds overhead. Kind of hard to back this thing up because it's so small. It doesn't go at all where you want it to. So I'm going to do something pretty maverick. Yeah, same here. Same here. It's, uh... It's not as bad as it was outside right now, so... I did lose a couple frames, unfortunately. I was kind of afraid that was going to happen, but... I just seen a real bright flash, and I was like... Man... It's definitely, uh... Definitely hailing outside. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can hear that or not. But I have like a metal uh, awning behind me. Uh, it's pretty loud. I didn't even know it was going to thunderstorm. There we go. That's one way to do it. All right, I'm going to jump off of this real fast and grab the tractor and the loading wagon. And then uh, I'm gonna load up some of this grass Yeah, uh, especially around here, it gets, it could be sunny one minute, it could be pouring down rain the next minute, and then it could be sunny while pouring down rain, it's, it's crazy. Let's see what happens here. Hopefully we don't get the tractor stuck like we did the one time. That's so much grass. Automatically went up to like 44%.
There we go. All right, let's save. And now we'll see where we are going to. Um, here we go. There's only like one or two places that you can sell grass at. Farmer's Market, I believe that's the one straight back. Back here, yep, okay, I know where that's at. It's a lot of grass. Uh-oh. Yep. Here we go again. That was that was a major problem I had last Sunday was with the tractors just bogging down completely. Um and I never really real realized that it was that bad uh on any other map that i played in this game so i wonder if it has something to do with this map or not because last sunday i did a contract for cultivating uh on the field in front of the equipment shop and i feel like it took about four times as long as it should have because the um the vehicles just bogged down so much that it kept switching back and forth in between gears trying to stay at the right speed yeah i probably should do that but i don't have any sheep i don't plan on getting any for the time being that's not good Yep, yep. It I may uh I may have some issues just because of the weather. Uh, it's totally out of my control, unfortunately. It says it's back up now. But I had about I don't know, one of the largest tractors in the game pulling a cultivator and it just kept downshifting to medium gear and then once I would hit a, a you know a certain mile per hour then it would upshift into high gear and then it would bog down again and then it would downshift back into medium gear and it just kept doing that back and forth back and forth so um, long story short it took about four times the amount of time that it should have to get that field cultivated uh, just because my tractor was was bogging down so slow not really sure why it did that um, kind of like just now when I was pulling out of my farm how it just kind of started downshifting kind of started slowing down it I don't really think it has anything to do with the weight of the trailer because like I said, I had like one of the most powerful tractors pulling a small cultivator and it, you know, it would barely do anything going up the hill. So I want to think, I want to think it's something to do with this map. Maybe I, I have no idea. If you check out the last Sunday on the farm, you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. And... It's just pretty inconvenient because I don't ever remember this issue happening basically on any other farm. But then again, I mean, the other farm that I did was was basically completely flat. There was really no elevation to any of the fields that I had in my last several farms. So I don't know.
I missed a little bit. A big old flash of lightning there. Man. I could feel that. go that's crazy this this storm just came out of nowhere because I mean it's been steady raining basically all day now have a thunderstorm mixed in with it see look at this That's exactly what I'm talking about right there. I just feel that's a little bit too exaggerated. But I get it, a big old trailer full of heavy grass. That reminds me. Okay, we're still at $100. All right. So I got like a thousand bucks for the last trailer. We'll see what we do with this one. I thought these things made weird noises, but they don't. Yeah, I did see that. Like the like some kind of productions DLC. I say it's all over Reddit. Everybody was posting about that the other day. It's pretty wild looking stuff. Ooh man, that's a loud clap of thunder going on. Rattling my windows. Oh man, that's that's cray cray. All right, now we're back over fifty one thousand. Yeah, it does look interesting. I just wonder how much it's gonna cost. cruise control on here let me get a little sippy a little Mississippi here oh man I don't know if I'd pay that much Joel what's going on welcome Hope you're having a good Friday, Jewel. Dog's stomach growling. Just got off work. Nice. Yeah, I went to Walmart today. I was checking out Nintendo Switches, three fifty for the uh, one with the dock and the and the two controllers that come off the side. I don't know anything about them, so um, but that was a little bit cheaper than the last time I had looked at them. But the last one I looked at was like a special Zelda edition, so I could understand why that one was more money. That was like three ninety nine. Um, I probably should have bought that one at the time, but they had like all kinds of different cases for them and stuff. Screen protectors, different colored 
uh, control the controllers that go on both sides, different colors of those. Yeah, I was gonna. I was. I was wanting to get a PlayStation Portal, um, but just like the PS5, scalpers have made those impossible to find. Um, so I just decided I'm just gonna get a Switch instead. So I don't care if people consider them outdated and old hardware and all that stuff. Like, we got Sega Game Gears. Those things are like 30 years old almost. So. I don't want to hear it about no outdated stuff. Well, that's outdated for you. They're so outdated they don't they don't even make that weird noise. Are they supposed to be like or something? Yeah, these. They don't they don't have that function. Bought the wrong model, you know. <laughs> oh man here I'll put the hat back on we'll, we'll, we'll stream with this on for, for, for a little bit there we go It is. It is my 40th birthday today. I kind of made a weird noise there. I don't know. My dog hates this thing. I better stop. I, I woke her up. Sorry. I cannot believe that it's storming. Hey, thank you. Thank you very much. My motto of the day today is I may be 40 years old, but don't ever let anybody tell you that you're too old to play video games. Don't ever let anybody tell you that you're too old to enjoy yourself because I enjoy playing video games. Obviously, my YouTube channel is a video gaming channel. And as far as I'm concerned, I'll, I'll freaking play video games until the day I die, you know, because I love them that much. What's going on over here? I thought I got all this stuff. Okay, I'm only going to be able to wear this thing in certain intervals because that string cuts the crap out of my throat. I'll put it on like every half hour. That'll work. And I mean, I got, I got a whole, I got a whole thing, so I got enough for everybody and the little, and the little blowout things too, so everybody can have one. Oh man, that's going to be a loud one. That was another bright flash of lightning. I can feel that one too. That's crazy. I didn't know anything about thunderstorming today. I just thought it was going to rain. I didn't know it was going to be doing all this. Maybe I should have mowed up front first. Make my house look presentable. Well, 
around my barn. Yeah, birthday hype it up. <laughs> you guys are you guys are all I got to celebrate with, so Like I said, I got a, I, I bought a cake and these hats and everything for the guys at work, but by the time I got back, they were already gone, so. I figured I'd do some streaming and we could all celebrate together. I don't know how I just did that. <laughs> Dog looking at me all crazy. I'm trying to do some kind of like landscaping around the flagpole or something. Hey, thanks, SP. I appreciate that. I tell you, when I, like I said, I went to Walmart earlier. I got this huge thing of uh, baked ziti. That looks so good. Probably have that for dinner tonight. Hard to tell where I've been in some spots. There we go. Man, I'm just, I'm kind of bummed about my old farm. I really don't know what happened to that. I can't believe it just, it just deleted itself somehow. I'm not really sure what happened. I don't. I don't think it was on the PS4 version because I have I have both versions of this game on here. That might be loud. There's some pretty intense lightning going on out there. It wasn't that bad. Hi, little girl. Let's see if I can't get close to this planter. Hi, baby doggy. Let's see those weeds like growing up out of the middle of it somehow not really sure what's up with that can't get rid of them there we go awesome shepherd's pie that sounds really good 
My oh, baby dog. My oh, baby girl. I can't even tell you the last time I had some. Been too long. Man, I'm making myself really hungry now just thinking about it. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, yeah, I know. It is it is what it is, though. I mean, I've, I can't even tell you how many times that's happened to me in Farming Simulator. My mobile version, well, the original one I did in Farming Simulator Mobile, well, 23 deleted somehow. No, no idea what happened there. Uh, tough, tough steel productions tried calling me right as I was like getting ready to play it and something weird happened and like my phone reset and when it came back my save game was gone so not really sure what happened there but it happens so nothing that I can do about it It's kind of a bummer because I put so much time into that last farm. I was kind of shocked that I couldn't find it when I got on here today, that this was the only farm on here for some reason. When this is this one was the multiplayer one. I didn't know that it saved under your under your your saved farms, um, but that doesn't still doesn't explain where my other save game went like it's just not even on here i'm almost wondering if it's on the ps4 version that i was playing it might have been because i played the ps4 version for the longest time because i was the only one out of my friends that played it at the time that had a ps5 um all my other friends had ps4s so i got the ps4 version just so we could all play together And now, Tough Steel Productions doesn't do online gaming anymore, and um, Firefighter is not going to play basically until the end of summer, so I guess I can just start playing on the PS5 version again. Ninety eight, ninety nine. I'm really sorry to hear that. That's that's a huge bummer. 300 hours and you lost it. You got my condolences on that one. That's that sucks, man. Like, I don't even know what to say. That sucks. I'd just stop playing. See how big of a mountain of grass we can get here. Uh oh. That 
That doesn't sound good. Yeah, it gets to a certain height and then it'll stop and then I'll have to like pull forward a little bit. Because it is completely buried in the grass at the moment. It's still going though. Usually it, uh, there it goes. So usually it stops and you have to pull forward. There we go. Yep, so uh, just a little bit bigger than uh, what the zero turn could produce. I got you, so that's how it started. I see. Well, maybe it was meant to be that guy for a reason. Let's see if I can't get those weeds that were right along the side of my garage here. There's no lights on this thing, I forgot. Uh, kinda got him, sorta. Oh my goodness. No, it's not gonna let me get him. We need that weed eater mod. If that'll even work with them. Probably not. Who knows? I'm not worried about it though. might try to flatten out that bump back there too once I get a little bit more money and I start doing some more landscaping it's not fun to drive over that thing Yep, I, I wouldn't jinx it either.
in these trees here. Always something about mowing around trees that... Especially with this bag on here. really need to go at him from the opposite direction to make it work. So that, I'm assuming is a weeds. Yeah, it won't let me cut those. Whoa, oh, that's a rock. Didn't see that. There we go. That was close. I can hear my dad now. You scratched up the lawnmower, man. You drove it against the tree. Yeah, that's that's what happened on uh, not the last time me and Tough Steel Productions and Kentucky Gamer all played together. I thought, oh, I'll save some time. Oh, I'll, I'll go to the grass pile by just driving down this uh, this little bump right here. Yeah don't recommend doing that I fell upside down and got stuck upside down in the tractor and then um, luckily Kentucky gamer was able to come over and, and push me right side up yeah I would not recommend doing that um, drive over at your own risk I guess <laughs> Cool, no problem. Oh, you seen that? Nice. <laughs> that, was, that was quite the experience. Learning experience. We'll add that to the don't ever do that again folder. Uh oh, why did I do that? There we go. Wow, that recovered a lot better than I was expecting. So there's some spots of grass next to the trees that I just can't get. It won't let me. So that won't be perfect, but it'll be as close to perfection as I can get it. This little patch right here, it just drives right through it and doesn't do anything. Unfortunately, that's okay. Wow, I, I actually was able to mow those bushes out. That's weird. Well, to an extent, I was. I don't know if it's just because the colors of the trees those shadows are starting to get pretty long. It's almost like it's starting to get evening time already. It's only 2 o'clock game time. 2.30. But it is November. 
and I know around here that time of year it starts getting dark like every 15 20 minutes it seems like so Right. So the question is, how in depth do I really want to get with this mowing? Because I could go all out. Or I could do another contract, try to get some money. I don't know what to do. Definitely needs mowed, that's for sure. So I'll at least mow around the farm. I just don't know how much mowing I want to do around the farm. Whoa. Because, I mean, it looks like for the most part right now, this stuff is... All good. Like you said, uh, hopefully I don't drive off the side right here. That was kind of sketchy. These rocks. Don't know if it'll let me mow this grass or not. It does. That was really close. <laughs> that was almost too close. I can really hear my dad now. You drove the mower off the side. What the heck are you thinking? Why were you trying to mow up there anyway? I didn't even know that was a thing right there, so good to know that. Alright, I'm just going to say that's good for that little strip right here. I don't think there's much... Oh, I'm stuck on a rock. I don't think I can, uh, I don't think I can mow much more of this stuff. Here we go. I don't know how that got there. I might have did that on accident. I don't know. There was another square over there uh, that I hit on accident. Because I do remember Tough Steel asking like where that grass square came from. The one that's up in the driveway. Well, it's not there now. Interesting. Well... That may have been for me when I was doing the weeds, getting all the weeds out of here. It does look so much better now that there's not uh, tons of those weeds all over the place. That looks so terrible, in my opinion. Welcome back, my guy.
I wonder if there, if you could just dump all the grass out into a big pile like I have been doing and then drive a tether over it if it will if it will like spread it out or if it will if it will even work I don't even know you guys know Ninety-six, ninety-seven. I bet a tether wouldn't even work. Or, I mean, you'd make such a crazy mess. You'd probably spread all the grass out all over the place, make it all freaking crazy everywhere, and then, you, and then you'd have to go through. Because, I mean, it already does that kind of when it's on the ground. If you notice, when you drive over grass with a tether, it, it, it shoots it out in every direction. I wish we got a little bit closer. I'll put the hat back on. It's time again. There we go. No word off to the side. No, that's too weird looking. There we go. That works. Maybe I should do like multiple ones. Let's try. <laughs> yes all right we got horns all right there we go let's go for three okay all right we'll push these back there we go it's a purple one <laughs> Reminded me of my old punk days, you know? All right, there we go. Uh, wait a minute. <laughs> this is crazy, people. All right, there we go. Sweet, where's my guy at? Oh, man, okay. <clears throat> Uh-oh. <laughs> Stuck in the grass. Oh, we're going to have to reset it. All right. Um, whoa. Wait, you know what? I'll just collect the grass. <laughs> this is crazy. Oh, man. Where's that... Hopefully my dog don't wake up. She hates this thing. Okay. Here we go. I'm a lawnmower in there somewhere. Whoa, there we go. All right, that should work. Okay. Uh-oh. 
she doesn't like it. Okay, sorry. Sorry, little doggy. Okay. Let's see if that works. Hey, there we go. Awesome. Thanks. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh, man. <clears throat> Go back up here to where we have our little turnaround spot. Hey, thank you, Janet. Thank you very much. Really appreciate that. Oh, no. Why? Forgot to lower the pickup. Oh, man. There we go. Okay. Yeah, there's going to come a point where I'm not I'm not going to be able to mow anymore because it's going to be too dark. This mower doesn't have any lights of any kind. So I'm just going to be kind of mowing in the dark. You and me go mowing in the dark. Something, something. I don't know how that song goes. Something about mowing in the dark or something. Or fishing in the dark. You and me go fishing in the dark. Did that before once and dropped my pole in the water and then it was gone forever. <laughs> True story. Kind of sucks, but. Look back and laugh on it now, but at the time it was a real travesty because that was my dad's. Was it my grandpa's? I don't remember. What we used to do as a kid is uh, we basically fish all day and then get uh, get catfish lines ready. So we would um, basically cast out just on the bottom, basically go inside when the sun went down, play Uno for like a couple hours. And then uh, I'd say like every half hour, 45 minutes, we'd go down and check our lines and see if we got any catfish. Usually we did. But there had been, you know, some times where really strange things happened. Like, I can remember one time as a kid. Okay, time out. I gotta take these off because they're killing my throat again. All right. Man, that sucks. Not made for a fat guy's neck, apparently. Um, I can remember one time I went down there just by myself. I had a flashlight with me. And uh, we had, like, a, a fish basket off the side of the boat. And I remember like I heard a I heard a splash and I shine the light down on the fish basket and there was like a snake wrapped around it and it was like trying to poke its head into the fish basket. And 
that scared the great googly moogly out of me because I was just a little kid and that had to have been one of the first snakes I ever seen in the wild. I just, I thought it was a king cobra. I was like, dude, there's a king cobra down there trying to get into the fish basket. And they were like, oh yeah, right. Like, believe me if you want, but like when my dad went down there, there was nothing there. And he was like, there ain't nothing here, man. And I'm like, I figures. So almost four o'clock game time and it is getting dark. So it comes with the territory in November, I suppose. There's 68 percent. I guess I'll just stop when it gets too dark to see what I'm doing, um, and then I'll go to sleep be December um, probably do a contract if I get to a you know a good stopping point with the mowing I don't want to like do something crazy with it like half cut or something weird That was weird. Thumb slipped. That wind is uh, starting to get pretty strong out there. I don't even think, uh, I don't think we have a tether. That's a weeder. Yeah, we don't even have a tether, so... I don't know if I want to get one just to test that or not, but I don't, I don't think I do. Because if it works, I'm gonna, I'm gonna need to get a wind rower. All that stuff. I don't know if I want to do all that. We'll try not to be completely overwhelmed by the grass this time. You know, it's kind of a bummer that there's no there's no headlights on this thing. Engineers at John Deere are probably just like, why would you why would you be mowing grass at in the dark anyway. I mean, that's crazy. This does take a lot longer to unload than I remember.
Oh yeah, we're definitely not going to have much time left. The zero turn was quick and I had a wider mower deck on it, but I feel like it did not hold as much grass for some reason. Maybe that was just in my head. In my head. Zombie, zombie, zombie. Yeah, I think it's I think it's about that time. Get this mower up here because this is where I'm going to start. Or I might just do a pass. One final pass go all the way up to my house. Yeah, I'm going to do that. The death line. Yeah, I remember you from the other night. Welcome back. Oh man, there's where I stopped mowing. Whoops. Just kind of slowly work my way over there. There we go. Like I didn't even miss it. Hey, thank you. Thank you very much. Really appreciate that. All right, guys, I... You know what? Let's uh Let's park this sucker in the driveway. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I'll Probably be a little bit dark in the morning, but uh, it'll get light pretty quick, hopefully. Awesome. I, re I really appreciate that. Thank you. Wow, it's actually about the same amount of light as it was. That's... Kind of funny. But it'll slowly get brighter out, so... Oh man, yeah, it is... Pretty dark, so... At least I can kind of see where I've been mowing. Kind of. Probably just get this this small area finished right here, uh, and then uh, see what all contracts there are to take on. I just heard a really weird noise. Hey, thanks. I had a little bit of practice from earlier. This is the, uh, this is a new lawnmower, so 
For those that didn't see earlier when I first started streaming, I sold the zero turn. Well, I didn't sell it. I just returned it because we were leasing it, but um, I returned it and got this instead because I feel like this held more grass in the uh, in the little trailer than the zero turn did because I felt like every five seconds I'd have to stop and empty that thing out and I, I did have the upgraded uh, grass collection system uh, it's just the uh, just the mod hub on the on the home page This is the John Deere 56. Is that right? Hold on a sec. I believe that's what it's called. John Deere 56. Yep. And it's only $850. Just a fraction of the price of the zero turn. This is actually the mower that I originally had on my original farm that I started. I can't even remember when. Modland? I've never even heard of that before. I have to look into that. Any games they have also. Yeah, I'll, I'll give that I'll give that a gander later on. I'll check that out. Yeah, now those storms have passed, my internet connection seems just fine now, so I'm sure that's all it was earlier was just the was just the storm. Here comes the sun. I am 40 years old today. Can't even can't even believe it myself. That's hard to believe. I'm that old now. <laughs> Very hard to believe. I'm sure he's around. I know he said he just got off work, so maybe he's getting uh, getting situated or something. All right.
go over here to Big Grass Mountain. Add to it. And we'll see. Yeah, I've got grass in the trailer, so this should be enough to fill the trailer, I would think. Maybe. Well, I don't know. Maybe not. We'll see. He, he might have been uh, referring to uh, my game because it was getting really, really dark because it was the nighttime while well, the sun was starting to go down. I said that once it got too dark to see, I'd probably go to sleep so we could start the next day or the next month. Popular. I wish. Yeah. Yeah, I had like seven earlier at one point. Not bad for just a guy, an old guy mowing grass. Don't hit the mower. Okay. Here we go. Eighty seven. There we go. Uh oh, wait a minute. I'm sure it's not $100 at the farmer's market anymore. Oh man, it's 101. There we go. Score. All right, so what I'm planning on doing is selling this grass at the farmer's market. And then I am going to check out what all contracts are available for the time being because I'm kind of getting tired of mowing grass it's still not even as much grass as I mowed a couple weeks ago on the uh, on the Sunday morning or the Sunday evening or whatever I tried to I tried to mow around the whole entire farm uh, Kentucky gamer and tough steel we're actually working hard on the field, getting it ready to go, and I'm just sitting there mowing the whole time. <laughs> like, you guys have already got to have fun with the zero turn. I haven't got to touch it yet. So, it is what it is. Anyway, thanks for the, uh, thanks for the tips there, buddy. Playing farm sim yourself? Nice. Yeah, it's it's kind of hard to to have a full time YouTube channel and a full time job both at the same time. I'm trying to get. Um, trying to get everything squared away from my channel membership but I kind of feel like I need to do a lot more stuff on YouTube and right now at work at my job is kind of 
we're really in our in our busiest part of the year so i really feel like it it wouldn't be how could i say this i, I, I wouldn't be wouldn't be worth it to do a, a, a membership thing just yet for my channel thanks joel thank you so much Farmland is a British man. Yep. Oops. Oh, he's turning. Okay. Good. Hey, thanks for the love, guys. Probably just scoop up the rest of this grass. Just so I don't have a big grass mountain hanging around. I guess, I mean, I don't know. Although I probably could just leave it, but. Okay. I'm just gonna just park it right here by this tree that's that's a good spot we'll just leave all our equipment out in the middle of nowhere just there we go all right let's see what we got here for corn tracks plowing field five That's not too bad. I'm pretty sure that's a fairly flat field. Fairly flat field. Say that five times fast. All right. We'll go ahead and do that, I guess, for the time being. Just because 2600 bucks. I got my own equipment. Sounds like a Nokia. Oh, I don't, I don't hear it. I, I can barely hear anything. I, I, I just barely have my TV turned up because if I, if I turn it up any louder, it'll, you, it'll start feeding back to the microphone, and I'll have like a really weird echo, and ain't nobody got time for that. So I ain't doing it. So. 
that's that. Um, I go. Okay. I see where we're going. Get your driver and farm sin, you'll send a link. You use Amazon. We go in here. But... Okay, it's this next one. All right, I know where I'm at now. Whoa, man! Sorry to inconvenience you all. Going on here. Don't do it, dude. Don't do it. Oh. All right, here is our field, right? Yep, this is it. Go reach. Yeah, this is fairly flat. Fairly flat field. <laughs> there I am turning all the lights on again because I hit the wrong button. What is that a shadow of? Oh man, a silo. That's crazy. Like a big old uh, sundial. On the ground. That's... That's fun. Get to the edge of the field here. I want to see something. Alright. Hold Oh man, yeah, it is uh it is dark off on the horizon. Fifteen PS fives about as many PS fives as I have PS twos. <laughs> Hey Oliver, how's it going? Welcome to the farm. See, the tractor's not doing bad now that this is a flat field. Yeah, you, you add any elevation to it at all, I guarantee you it's going to start doing that weird thing where it keeps upshifting and downshifting and trying to find the best gear. Can sell cars in Fortnite? 1901 Ford something. Huh. Could be a used car dealer in Fortnite. 
I haven't played Fortnite since that game came out. <clears throat> You're good, glad to hear that, man. Oh, well, thank you very much. I really appreciate that. I'm supposed to have a... I'm supposed to have a, uh, a notification that pops up whenever anybody subscribes or anything, but it hasn't been doing that for some reason. I don't know what, I don't know why it's not working. But yeah, thank you, thank you so much for subscribing. I really appreciate that. Great demand at the farmer's market. If it's for grass. Game on. I doubt it though. <laughs> Why would there be a great demand for grass? That's funny. A guy can only dream. You touch grass? Farmland is an AI and British man. What, what makes you think he's AI? Oh no, he was chatting with me earlier. He's he said he's playing farming sim 
right now as well, so... <laughs> Thanks for the love. I don't I don't beg for people to donate money to me if they want to then they do. I'm not going to ask for it. I'm not that guy. <laughs> Chevrolet, we are Nokia. Yeah, I have, I have no idea why my notification thing isn't working. I thought I had it set up right, but apparently I don't for some reason, because Oliver said that he subscribed to me, but I didn't get... I didn't get any kind of notification that said that anybody subscribed. I don't know if you guys seen anything or not, but I didn't see anything. I thought I had it set up to where if that happened, I could see it, but... I might have to do something else. I'm not really sure. Oh, nice. Wool and eggs, that's the breakfast of champions right there. <laughs> One hundred million dollars. Man, can I get a loan from one of you guys? That'd be nice. Zero percent interest if possible, please. Thanks. <laughs> we can do a zero percent loan that's no problem i promise i'll pay you back i know i was just kidding i was just joking
Yeah, just when I thought I was done with the dentist, they were like, oh, we're going to schedule you another appointment for the 23rd. And I'm like, man, I thought I was done with all this stuff. Wouldn't be bad if it was free. <laughs> yeah, pay for it though. That's expensive. But I actually I checked out the. Uh, the bike guards at Walmart and I got one this morning so definitely will be wearing that thing from now on because my nighttime teeth grinding is what got me into this situation to begin with I have a real bad problem with grinding my teeth in my sleep and I've broken several teeth doing it and that's not fun and the last time was was by far the worst uh, i mean my jaw got infected you know, it looked like i had a looked like i had a golf ball stuffed in my cheek it was bad uh, it hurt really really bad hey there buddy I had, I've had several bite guards, but I actually uh, I, I left my last one in California the last time I went out there, so a lot of good it does me out there. It's probably long gone now. Hey, Jaden, thank you so much. Really appreciate that. FS19 are the best. I'm, I've got, I've got like two farms on there. Oh, you're looking at it. I have uh, really nobody to celebrate with, so I figured I'd celebrate with all you guys. These are these are basically my plans. You're getting ready for your new farm? Nice.
Well, it's not taking too awful long to do this field. Kind of a bummer that all there are, as far as contracts are plowing contracts, but it is what it is. I forgot to I forgot to roll my field that I have my uh, oil seed radish in, so I just I just thought of that. Don't have a roller, so I should probably need to lease one of those. Be some mulcher. <clears throat> um, <clears throat> excuse me. I don't know. Uh, I, I really don't have much, so um, maybe, maybe go see my dad this weekend. Maybe uh, the rest of my family lives in California, so gonna be a little difficult to do that uh, my dad's my dad's babysitting until forget when he said like eight o'clock or something like that so I'll probably see him this weekend at some point maybe my stepmom I guess whenever I get tired of playing, I wasn't really going to end anytime soon. I don't really have any, don't have any plans or anything. So, um, yeah, I was just planning on just playing and streaming for the evening. Sure would like to know what's up with my notifications. It's kind of that's kind of weird. I thought I had everything set up the right way, but apparently not. I don't know. I don't know what all I need to do to fix that because I thought I, I thought I did everything I was supposed to do. like winter but sometimes not yeah same here I wouldn't mind the winter here if we actually got snow but usually it's just like bitterly cold and windy and we don't ever get any snow anymore so kind of a bummer I mean, we haven't gotten a good snowfall here, and I can't even tell you how long. Why use correction in YouTube? Uh, I, I watched a I watched a YouTube video on um on how to set it up, but obviously it's it's not working because I didn't see. It's supposed to come on a thing where it says like somebody subscribe to your channel or whatever and it's supposed to make a weird noise and stuff, but I may have done it wrong. I'm not sure. I tested it about a thousand times on the website, but 
I'm not really I'm not really sure. You gotta go at 626. Okay. That's kind of a specific time. Hey, thanks for the love. Wow, that could have ended badly. I joined YouTube in 2013. Um, but I didn't start making videos on YouTube until maybe 2015. And then my, my YouTube channel was kind of all over the place. I really didn't know like what I wanted to do with it. Um, and then just one day I just decided I'm just going to start making uh, video game videos and video game related content. So a lot of my earlier stuff was um, like sim racing videos and uh, and Mortal Kombat videos. I've kind of I've kind of gotten away from that stuff, especially the Mortal Kombat stuff. Two years of inspiration for my channel. I've been I've been trying to stream Farming Simulator every every Sunday uh, since since around 2020. I used to do it every Sunday morning, um, but then I have a lot of friends and family that live in California, and they were like, "When you stream, it's just way too early for us." So. If you could stream a little bit later, that would really be awesome. So I really didn't have a, like a, a set time that I was streaming. I was just, you know, waking up early in the morning, doing it every Sunday morning. And then I decided since the people on the West Coast couldn't watch, I would start doing it at a decent time. So I started doing it at 6 p.m. And kind of been doing it there ever since. Alright, the death life. Take care. Thanks for stopping by. So we are definitely getting close to the end of the field here, finally. Take it easy.
I might do uh, do the rest of this contract. Kind of get everything back to where it is, and then I might I might switch over to Farming Simulator 23. I don't know. I wish I knew what was going on with those notifications. I don't understand why those didn't pop up on my screen. It's kind of unfortunate because I spent like a good part of the day trying to get all that stuff set up and it didn't even work. Which is kind of which is kind of wild because I tested it out. I'm doing it through Stream Elements, and I went to their website, got everything the way I wanted it. I thought I did anyway. I, don't know, I may just stay I may just stay on this game just keep playing this game I might take a break uh, go use the restroom get something else to drink maybe take like a maybe, maybe take like a five minute break what's up SP Hey, Wendy, how's it going? Welcome to the farm. Definitely not much left now on this field. I don't know if I'll be able to get it all done in one more pass or not. It might take two. Just looking at it anyway. I 
Wow. Okay. Let's say we were done. I think it did. We'll get this we'll get this last pass down. And then, uh, and then head back to the farm. Uh oh. Well, that's not good. <laughs> the arms go up. I do not, I do not have any social media at all. YouTube is it. You can't do that while you're turned. There we go. Alrighty. I'm just gonna drop the plow off. I really don't want to do the other plowing contract after that. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna hook up to this. Okay, I'm gonna take like a, uh, maybe like a five minute break, uh, just because I plan on streaming for, for quite a while tonight. So I'm gonna go uh, use the restroom, get something to drink, uh, and I will be right back. So if you guys wanna stick around, feel free. If not, have a good evening. Uh, I will be right back, guys. I'll see you here in a few minutes.